you'll understand more about the risks and rewards. You'll have fewer dud funds in your portfolio and you'll feel much more relaxed about investing. Put together a free investing course based on some videos that I've made and this will help to make you a better fund investor. Links to all the videos and the playlist are in the description to this video. So the first video looks at the key principles behind investing success and that will really set you up for your investing future. Next we look at funds that are able to pick the winning companies. There's not many of them, but what's the best way to go about finding them? There are three main types of funds, investment trusts, exchange traded funds and open ended investment companies. This video looks at the advantages and disadvantages of each and it considers which one might, might be best for you based on things like how much money you have to invest each month. Exchange traded funds are a very popular way of investing. There's a lot of innovation in this space with new ETFs being launched on a weekly basis. In this video, I take you through in depth how to select the best exchange traded funds using the website justetf.com. Factor investing can be a good way to increase your returns possibly or to be more comfortable over the sorts of companies that are selected for your desired fund. So something like a quality factor is often very popular among people in their 50s where they don't invest in a whole load of duff loss making companies. And this video looks at how I selected my very favorite exchange traded fund that has price growth, it's diversified and potentially has lower volatility than a global tracker. Investment trusts have had some poor performance recently, but there is a way to find a diamond in the rough. So let's have a look at them in this video and work out what their key features can be and how to find the best ones. When you're reviewing your portfolio, sometimes you realize that you need to sell a fund because of maybe poor performance or it just doesn't fit in with your investment objectives. This video looks at the criteria around selling a fund. Investment risk is often seen as volatility, but that's not often the case. The true risk is an underperforming fund. That means if you put your money in it, you simply won't be able to retire when you think. So this is a new way of looking at risk. Don't buy bonds until you've watched this video. I go through all the different types of bonds, government bonds, corporate bonds, index linked bonds, whether in GBP or other currencies. So this is a really good overview of the bond market. So hopefully you know already that Vanguard is pants. The platform is very limited in terms of the funds that it has, and that's anti-competitive. And also some of their products like Life Strategy are really poor performers and you can easily find something better, and more suited to your needs. What is the best broker for you? Well, certainly if you're holding funds into your retirement, you're going to need to look at things like how much it costs to make a withdrawal from your pension. There's all sorts of additional criteria that you need to take into account. And that's what's featured in this video. There's a holy grail to investing where you find good funds with good performance, low volatility and no correlation between themselves. And when you've got that, You've got an amazing portfolio, which is explained in this video. I've done a series of videos on an income portfolio that I'm monitoring on a quarterly basis. This video looks at what's in the income portfolio and how it's performed. The ultimate retirement portfolio involves putting your portfolio into buckets in terms of short, medium and long term needs. For the long term needs you can afford to take a bit more risk and take a much longer term perspective on the funds that you have in that portfolio. So you can be invested in something like India, some thematic exchange traded funds maybe, or the NASDAQ. And you know that you can be happy with the risk because you might not access the funds for 20 plus years. And then in the short term portfolio, you can put things like maybe government bonds or money market. And then you know you don't have to withdraw from equities if you don't want to. This video looks at all of that in a lot of depth 
and will give you some ideas around constructing the ideal portfolio. But a course can never give you all the answers. And what you really need is coaching from someone who has been there, got the t-shirt where you understand a lot of their key views on investing, and then they can just have a short session with you to really do some personalization based around things like your needs and your psychology to really help you put together a portfolio that you're going to stick with for the long term. I'm Ian Shadrach, a qualified accountant with over 30 years experience. I offer portfolio coaching to individuals looking to put together a portfolio for their retirement. You can contact me via my website. And you can access all the videos I've mentioned for free. The links to the playlist and the individual videos are in the description.